There's no getting around it, Germany has solidly established itself as a top travel destination, not just for the knowledgeable few but also for the joyous masses of visitors from all over the world. If anyone wonders why, this country has a lot more to offer than what first appears, no rhyme intended. Enumerating all the attractions that make traveling to this country worthwhile would be a difficult undertaking, the reasons might be so varied and many that any attempt to narrow the list down to the finest ones would come off as arrogant and biased. But first make sure to subscribe to our channel. Let's start. Number 10. River Cruises on the Rhine and Main. The main waterways of Germany allow one to see the country from a unique perspective and gain an understanding of how significant a role some of the main rivers have played historically in the development of significant urban centers, Frankfurt, Mainz, Koblenz. One only needs to kick back and take in the mesmerizing beauty of the German countryside, with its captivating landscapes, elegant old castles perched on the nearby hilltops, and vineyards stretching as far as the eye can see. One of the most delightful parts of what is undoubtedly a spectacular tour is crossing the Rhine Gorge, a section of the river filled with lovely castles, as well as the Lorelei Rock, which towers above the river just as it was depicted by J.M.W. Turner. Number 9. The Carnival Season. The weekend in through Rose Monday, also on Mardi Gras in larger centers, just before Ash Wednesday is a wonderful opportunity to unwind and let yourself be carried away by tides of carnival celebrations that are simultaneously taking place in a number of cities and regions in Germany, especially its western and southwestern parts. The fifth season, as it is often known, features a riot of color, including elaborately adorned floats, flashy costumes of all kinds, strange sets that make fun of politicians, street dancers, and marching bands. Go to Cologne for a truly amazing carnival celebration to experience the warmth of this city, have a blast, and see the stereotypically reserved Germans in their party animal form. Number 8. Berlin Film Festival. The Berlinale is undoubtedly one of the glitziest events on the world cinematic calendar, but despite the glitz, the commerce, and the constant media attention, this prestigious film festival manages to keep a cool head by promoting and rewarding true artistry and innovation in filmmaking across a variety of genres, hence its various sections, including competition, forum, panorama, etc., and spanning the full spectrum. In addition to being a great time to visit Berlin, Attending the Berlin Ale is a great way to keep up with the latest trends and developments in the film industry. Up to 400 film projections are held throughout the festival, making it the largest film festival in the world based on audience attendance, over 300.000 tickets sold. Before we move further, subscribe to this channel and help us grow as a family. Number 7. City of Berlin. You must set aside some time to explore this city, young and old alike. The Berlin Ale, of course, the Carnival der Kulturen, the Fête de la Musique, the Long Night of the Museums, and many other events are certainly reasons in and of themselves to visit, but simply being exposed, while remaining open-minded, of course, to the creative stirrings of this vibrant city, with its alternative art scene, underground culture, and wild parties, is a stimulating experience. Utilize the energy in the area around Hackischhof and Oranienburgerstrasse to launch yourself into Berlin's nightlife. Number 6. Oktoberfest. Everyone, especially beer enthusiasts, should go to this fantastic festival at least once in their lifetime and take part in the enjoyment of downing consecutive maskrich while listening to later Hosenklad Oompa bands, feasting on Wurst, Hennel, and Schweinbraten, and generally celebrating all things Bavarian. It is understandable why so many people from across the world traveled to Munich to take part in this festival, as the mood is extremely upbeat in and around Die Wiesen, the festival's focal point, and the tents. Number 5. City of Munich. With its distinctive Baroque architecture, lovely parks, top-notch museums, surrounding castles, and its renowned beer gardens, the Bavarian capital city is a terrific destination to visit all year long, not just during Oktoberfest. Munich is a delightful city with many reminders of its regal past, especially in and around Marienplatz, being neither enormous nor little, it is about the right size and offers a wealth of attractions in a very compact space. Munich's extensive culture of beer gardens significantly enhances its friendliness. Number 4. German Food. You heard me right, German food is fantastic. One of the best things about Germany is the delicious food one gets to consume while there. 
Germany is a true culinary wonderland with its worst this and worst that, 1,500 different types of sausages, served with sauerkraut and potato salad, exquisite soups and stews, sauerbraten, schweinbraten, schwenkbraten, and other bratens, as well as hundreds of different types of bread, my favorite is brachen, all accompanied by the best beer in the world. Additionally, practically whenever you eat out, a large plate of food is served to you rather than a tiny dish that has been elegantly garnished. Number 3. City of Hamburg. I would relocate to this wonderful city and never look back if it weren't for the gloomy skies. Like very few other cities in the world, Hamburg offers an abundance of activities and attractions, as well as remarkable vitality and cosmopolitan flair. Hamburg offers an enormous range of outdoor activities due to its exceptional geographic location on the River Elbe, close to where it runs into the North Sea, with several canals and Lake Elster nearby, even beach sports, believe it or not. There are numerous sights to see during the day, such as the futuristic Hafen city, the Speicherstadt, the promenade along the Landungsbrücken, etc., and there is also the thrilling Reeperbahn nightlife district to discover at night. Whatever your passion, you'll adore this city. Number 2. Bachfest Leipzig. The Thomaskirchen Leipzig, where Johann Sebastian Bach worked as the Kapellmeister for the final three decades of his life, hosts this beautiful annual event for fans of classical music in general and of the renowned Baroque composer in particular. The festival, which annually showcases outstanding soloists and classical ensembles from around the globe, closes with a performance of the Mass in B minor at the Thomaskirch following the staging of around 100 different events. Before we tell you our last reason of visiting Germany, subscribe our channel and stay connected with us. Number 1. Frankfurt Book Fair. The Frankfurt Buchmesse is the biggest book fair in the world and not only one of the most significant events in the worldwide book publication calendar but also a media event of remarkable prominence, with nearly 7,500 participating exhibitors representing 110 countries. The fair first took place in 1476, not long after Gutenberg in the adjacent city of Mainz produced mechanical movable type. The Frankfurt Book Fair is a wonderful visual feast for the eyes and a real joy for book enthusiasts from all over the world because of its astounding variety of hues. It serves as a crucial forum for negotiating book-related economic agreements, including licensing fees and global publication rights. This reason completes our result, make sure to subscribe before you leave and you can comment down below your views. We love reading them.